Right, the Indian team's been picked and everyone's saying, so how are they going in the IPL? Let's break them down. Some have had really good IPL, some, well, as, as you'd expect, some struggling a little bit. So let's break them down. Who am I happiest with? Number one on that list is KL Rahul and he's been very lucky that Kings XI Punjab have given him that kind of role. They've allowed him the time, they've allowed him to play himself in and he's got a lot of balls and as a result a lot of runs. He's accelerated well at the end. He's looking a different player than he was a little while ago. So for me, the big plus is KL Rahul. Another big plus is Hardik Pandya. You might say, yeah, it's 12 balls and 15 balls and 20 balls. Can he play 60? We don't know. What we do know is over those 12, 15, 20, he is hitting the ball as good as anybody in the world. The positions he's getting into, the clean way in which he's hitting, he's playing with a smile, he's enjoying his cricket. So to me, Hardik Pandya is a plus. And you might get a little surprised by my third big plus, given that his economy rate is still very high, but he's bowled really well and that's Mohammad Shami. I'm very happy he's carried that white for the white ball form into, into T20 cricket as well. Occasionally at the end on these flat decks, you go for runs, but I've been very happy with the way Mohammad Shami has bowled. So those were the three big pluses. Who are the, well, predictable, expected? Virat Kohli has had uh, is a good IPL, he's got, he's got 100 as well. He's had other worries on his head. Virat Kohli the captain, Virat Kohli the franchise leader, that's separate. You don't have to worry about that for the IPL. Virat Kohli the batsman, yes, no issues at all. MS Dhoni, actually a little plus MS Dhoni because we all wonder how is he, how is he going to be. I mean, his form just before the IPL as a, as a one-day player also was quite good. But he's just, he's, he's batting well, he's looking in control. So to me, MS Dhoni, good. Jaspreet Bumrah, not as many wickets as normal, but Bumrah is still the go-to bowler. Bumrah is still bowling really well with the new ball. He's still the reliable person at the end. And Yajuwen the Chahal has bowled well too. For a side that's not done well, he's really been the standout bowler. So, those four, pretty good. Who did I expect a little bit more from? I would have liked to see more runs for Shikhar Dhawan. He's had one good innings, but Shikhar is always a little up and down. Hopefully, by the time he gets to England, he'll, be, he'll have faced enough uh, deliveries, he'll be in, in a good state of mind and Rohit Sharma. But the reason I'm not too worried about either Rohit Sharma or Shikhar Dhawan is that essentially, at heart, they're far better 50-over players than 20-over players. You just selected him purely for 20-overs cricket, maybe you look at somebody else. But Rohit Sharma over 50-overs is a complete, is a far better player than Rohit Sharma over 20-overs as indeed is Shikhar Dhawan. I'm happy to see that Bhuvneshwar is coming back as well. You know, he started off, we were wondering whether he's going for too many runs at the end. But the Bhuvi that we've seen coming up through the IPL is, uh, is, is showing signs of encouragement. The movie at this stage is better than the movie that started the IPL. There's a couple of players that I hoped would have done a lot better and I'm a little worried. Biggest worry is Kuldeep Yadav. Not just the runs that he's going, the fact that he's not deceiving the batsman in the air. I know he's playing on a lot of very, very flat pitches that are giving him absolutely nothing. It'll be different over 50 overs. They won't be attacking him so much. But just the fact that He's not beating the batsman in the air, the, the deception is not there. Maybe he's just tired. Maybe just send him away from the IPL for 10 days and say, go and see some movies. Go and just go and do what you want. Go for a long walk, do what you want and then come back. So Kuldeep Yadav, yes, a bit of a worry. And I wanted more from Vijay Shankar. He's got good batting positions. He's batted 3-4, three, 3-4 four, three, four or thereabouts for sunrises. I think uh, I think we'll right to expect a few more runs from him. So maybe now that the pressure of selection is over, maybe he'll go and deliver the innings that an India number four should. So there you are. That's that's India, the Indian players in in the IPL. Twenty overs a different beast from fifty overs, but we're looking at form, and that's what we've come up with.